Yeah, I'm back. All right. So I prepared the vegetables. Okay. This is curry chicken we're cooking now. Remember, this is part two. All right. So I prepared the onion, the scallion, and, and the tomato. Okay. For cooking. All right. So now, like I said, the chicken is ready. Okay. So first thing I'm going to do is put the seasoning in. All right. So I'm going to. Let me put this right here so you can see what I'm doing. All right, sorry. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do in the pot, you can see the pot right here, black pepper. All right, so you just wanna put the black pepper in. I mean, look, I don't measure shit. I just know, all right? After, you know, you know those um, cook show, or they measure this and quarter teaspoon of this, and you know, bullshit, you know, listen. Just put enough black pepper. You can see the whole little chicken is covered black pepper. You turn it around. Make sure your hands are clean, by the way. My hands are clean, all right? So we have enough black pepper, okay? All right? Then you put some adobo, all right? You don't want to put too much of this, all right? So that's it. Let's cover the chicken right there, all right? Old Bay seasoning, all right? You sprinkle some of that. This gives it the, the, all the flavors, all the juices and... All right, so you cover that. All right. All right, so yeah, so that's not that's enough right there. And my red pepper that's finishing, but so I'm just gonna throw the rest of that in there. That's done, garbage. And then some turmeric. All right, turmeric. Oh, believe me, turmeric is good for the health. Just put a little turmeric in there, right? And then the Jamaican curry curry powder. You're not now. It depends on how much chicken you're cooking. So you don't want to put too much Jamaican curry, all right? So right here, I would I would say, all right, give it, I don't have much inside here, but I'll say give it, a, give it a teaspoon and a half, all right? So teaspoon and a half, all right? That should, that should, that should, that should curry up everything, okay? All right, now, let me replace these over here off the stove. Put these back right here. So now that we have all our ingredients inside, now you wash your hands. Warm water. Wash your hands with warm water, all right? All right, now, you see it? Look at this, see that? Now, you take your hands and you stir it. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get that little flavor and juice inside it. The curry and you know all the other seasoning mixed up right all right all of this my mother teach me you know what i'm saying so so yeah you know, there you go now let me get a napkin wipe my nose there you go these days constantly have to wash your hands wash your hands because you don't know where this goddamn thing is but anyway if you can see this look that's the scallion, the tomato, and the onions, all right? So what I'm gonna do, first of all, you can't cook it without oil, all right? So you can use butter or oil. I use a little oil, so. Uh, okay, so I use Western, all right? Uh, this is Kelowna, canola oil, all right? So now, you don't want to put too much oil in this, all right? Cause oil make it all uh, insipid, okay? So what I would suggest, you just tip it, tip it, tip it, tip it, tip it, tip it. That's it. That's enough oil, because the chicken once the chicken start to basically cook, get warm, it's going to shrink the oil off the fat. Anyway, off the chicken of the fat. Uh, the, well. The fat of the chicken is going to burn off into that little oil you put in there. So you don't want to put too much oil, all right? All right, so let me clean the side here. You know, once you're cooking, you got to keep things clean, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know what I'm saying? You got to, because it saves your time, you know? Plus, you don't want to make things too out here all right so they put the oil in I'm gonna turn the stove on so I put the stove on 
and once this is brown I'm not going to put this in yet but I'm going to put this in after and let it brown and then once it's brown I'll come back with tape two all right tape three all right cooking curry chicken for all you ladies who can't cook so you can learn to cook something to satisfy your gentleman if he's home or if not you satisfy yourself and all you guys who are single who depend on someone to cook you can learn to do this you understand hopefully you know you gotta know how to monitor the stove I have an electric stove so it's easy to monitor gas stove I believe me I mean you know you gotta watch this stuff especially gas stove because gas stove can you know what I mean take you out of the house yeah all right we'll come back with tape three cooking curry chicken for all you people I'm helping you now in this COVID-19 tape three